Oh my god, Pokemon Go. Oh. Hello everybody, this is Dexahoy, and as you can see, it's time for Pokemon. Now, I got this today. It is live today. The day we have all been waiting for, Pokemon Go is here. Now, I spent the walk home catching Pokemon, being all cool. As you can see, I am level four, right there. Level four, don't I look sassy? I look amazing, look at me. Doot, 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 doot. I walk through the rain, wish I looked that awesome. What's this journal? Uh, start date was today. Yep, I don't have any teams. I don't know what that is yet. I'm sure it will. Oh, it's a shop. All right, so you can buy stuff in the shop. I know that a lot of you have been looking forward to Pokemon Go. I certainly have. I just want to make this quick video to sort of show what's going on. It's dropped in New Zealand. It's dropped in all in Australia. There are other places that it hasn't dropped yet. I downloaded the APK package to make this. What is Jogger? What does that mean? I've walked that, I've walked 2.42 kilometers. All right, so that's how much I walked today um, from work home. Uh, what's count? I registered eight Pokemon in, yeah, and I caught eight Pokemon. So, I mean, that's pretty good. Eight Pokemon in 2.42 kilometers. Uh, captured 13 Pokemon. All right, so you get little badges as you go along. I know I'm rushing through this a little bit, um, but I, <laughs> I made some tea and I burned my tongue on it and my tongue really hurts right now. But, <laughs> I, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's neither here nor there. Uh, this is really cool here. It tells you what- Oh my god, a Psyduck is nearby! <gasps> oh, I'm gonna have to remember that. Alright, alright. You stay there, honey. I might, I might come get you later. Oh man, Psyduck, that would be amazing. So it's quite cool. Here's the map. It shows you, uh, what's on, what's going on. These little things are like little, uh, Pokestops. And yeah, it's too far away because you gotta be near it. So you spin it, and then like Pokeballs and eggs and stuff shoot out, and it's really cool. Over here, I haven't gotten to be able to go to gym yet because you'll see Mr. Professor Willow, this dude, uh, says, Oh, you can't until you're level 5, so screw you. So I can't, uh, which is unfortunate, but I'm sure I will get level 5. Um, well, I got to level 4 from that just that one walk, and you get levels by catching Pokemon, um, here's my little Pokedex. These are all the Pokemon I've caught so far. Those are my little drowsies. I got in a, in a horsey as well. Got so many drowsies. Oh, this might be a good time to show you. So you got shop items. Here are your items. Um, Pokeball, incense. Oh, I got two incense. I didn't even see that. Um, you, you catch Pokemon by grabbing, like when they go do 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 and they appear, then you like flick your finger on the screen to throw balls and it's like, that's it, and then hits it, and you go, and I got it, yay! All right, let me see the Pokemon now. Now, a lot of people were asking, like, oh, how do I, how do I evolve? How do I do this? How do I do that? Well, let me show you. So these CPs are like their attack points, basically. Look at my Pidgeotto. It's awesome. Uh, the first one I caught, of course, was Charmander. He's my Charmander's my Bay. He's my first Pokemon ever in Pokemon Red, I believe. Is it Pokemon Red or Blue? I don't remember which. I have both of them, but I don't remember which one. But you can see it says Charmander Candy and Stardust. I haven't figured out Stardust yet, but you know, I've only had this game for like an hour. What? Go away. I'm trying to make record a video. That's what I'm trying to do. So it tells you you can evolve it, power up, so you uh, evolve it by getting these candies. These candies. And it shows where I caught it, it shows its attack points and its what's it. You can also transfer it. I'm not going to transfer him because I don't want to. So let's say, let's see, 43 drowsy, 43 drowsy, they're both the same, so I'm gonna transfer one. Now when you transfer, whoa, whoa, settle down. Yeah, it's a little bit buggy as well. Um, sometimes, like, when I get a message, the sound will cut out and I'll have to restart the whole game again. Um, I, it's only because, I think it's because I'm playing the APK version and not the uh, shop version that will come later today, I hope. Uh, but I couldn't not. Oh my god, it is looking amazing on this low quality stream. How about that, folks? How about that? There we go. Transfer. So you can't take it back, so you send it to the professor. And then you get Drowsy Candy, or Pidgey Candy, or Weedle Candy, whichever. And then you can use those candies to power up your Drowsy, or I'm saving up my Drowsy Candy 
uh, to evolve. Uh, so I mean, it's got some good. It's got some good animations. It's also ugh. see, it's it's bugging out again. There we go. It's got some good animations. It's got some fun little things. It's still a little bit hard finding finding um, Pokemon is kind of like uh, hot and cold. So that three steps means it's I, I I'm assuming it's three hundred feet away, or maybe that's yards, or maybe that's just sort of like. A hypothetical it's this far away and then when it gets closer it's two and then it gets closer even more one and you can click to sort of like GPS again and sometimes these change sometimes that's completely full of Pokemon and uh, yeah so that's oh what was that over there I thought I saw a little like when the when you see a little bit like right over there right over there you saw that there's a little bit of Pokemon stuff going on there apparently when it when it kicks up when it kicks up grass and stuff, that means it's near, but it's still a hot and cold thing. So we'll we'll see how it goes. We'll see. Uh, I'm sure I'm gonna enjoy it. I uh, I'm sure that lots of people are gonna catch lots of Pokemon. It'll be great. It'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, what sort of events they plan. I know that Ingress is uh, is is very similar to this. I played a little bit of that. But I quickly grew bored of it. But I think that's because of the actual plot of Ingress. Well, I should stop messing with this. <laughs> it's going all crazy. My screen's like, nope, I'm sorry. You're doing stupid stuff with your screen. Oh, see, there's that little, whoa, whoa. There's loads of them on that side of the river. I may have to go, hmm. There seems to be, like, there's a park right across the river over there. So, uh... Yeah, look at them! Look at them, they're all getting all awake now! Jeez, just, look at them, they're just taunting me. They're just taunting me because I'm here just chilling. And they're like, come catch me, come catch me! Assholes. So, I went out. Uh, that place uh, did not have anything. <laughs> so I went and uh, found a, 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 a starfish thing. A star, a star you. Star you. Yeah, here you go. Here you go. Check it. Look at those skills. Of course, I uh, couldn't record any of uh, any of the sound, so you will have to uh, like this old-fashioned Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow battle music while I uh, catch some things. Enjoy. the worst throw ever. As you can see, I am not the best at throwing these, but you know, it all comes into practice. Also, my screen was completely sodden with rain, because as you may not be able to see, but it is raining quite a lot. And it was, uh, it was very hard to, uh, see, there we go. Yeah, I was like, oh my gosh, a shelter. Oh, that's where the gym is. Oh, I think that was my best shot so far. Drowsies. There's loads of drowsies in that damn park. I caught maybe like 10 drowsies today, or maybe like eight. And then it did this weird thing. What the heck is this? I thought that my that it broke my my phone, but I guess it's one of these drowsy techniques because it soon repaired itself and everything was fine. This is quite cool. I got a a hell of a lot of Pokemon balls from this. Ah yes, the Paris of Jail. Now this one this one kind of faked me out a little bit. Goodbye, Pokeball. This one, this one jumped out, and I was like, oh yeah, I caught it, I caught it, everything's cool, everything's cool, I caught it. And I went on to walk on my merry little way, I've got like a phone cover, that's my phone cover as you can see, and then I was like, wait, what's, why, why can't I see myself on the, wait, why is there a Paris still there? Wait, what's going on? It escaped its Pokeball. I didn't catch it. I got too greedy. I caught it that time though. Or did I?
Yeah, I got it. <laughs> now, here we go. I've leveled up, and I thought, oh, well, there's a gym right over there that's been taunting me. And this, this gentleman comes up, this willow guy. He gives you this big spiel, and he's like, Hey, now you need to pick sides. Which is kind of annoying, because I don't really like to pick sides. I think looking back retroactively, I probably should pick a different team. Uh, but we've got your yellows, uh, your blues, and um, your the red's going to come up in just a sec. There we go. And I'm, I just realized that's because of the Pokemon red, blue, yellow colors. And also, those are the main, like, color things. Poor Bulbasaur. <laughs> Nobody wants to pick Bulbasaur. <laughs> so I picked Team Valor because my first fire, my first Pokemon was fire type. Um, and here you will see, I was like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna power up my, there we go. I'm gonna power up my Pokemon so that we can fight this gym battle and everything's gonna be cool. And here we go. I'm gonna fight Jigglypuff with my drowsy. They don't give you any, any, any tutorial for this. They just go, go. And so I got my, my butt handed to me. Cause I'm like, what's going on? And then I clicked that button thinking it was something. And then I kept getting, and then I had messages coming in and then I kept getting and I was like, oh, I can swipe left and right. So basically combat is you swipe left and right to dodge attacks and you click on the main, the, the middle Pokemon to attack them. I died rather quickly because I didn't figure that out quick enough. So I went back into the gym battle, as you'll see. And I went with my slightly lesser cool Pokemon. And I got a few hits in, but I got a, a little bit of a wallop. But this one was alright. I got my tactics down, even though, it's, as you can see, it's not very effective. So, regular Pokemon attributes apply. And, uh, ooh. This one, this one was down to the wire. Dodging main attacks there. I'm not sure how you can do a main attack. But, uh... I'm sure I'll figure it out as time goes on. And yeah, there we go. So I won. I won my, my gym battle. But I bet if I attacked again, because that, that Jigglypuff's there, I haven't beaten the gym. I just beat one gym battle. So there's that. Well, I hope you liked it. Um, there's a lot of things that I really enjoyed. I will continue to play it. And, uh, join me. See you out there.